Picking the right camera for astrophotography is surprisingly difficult, as you both need to make sure it actually matches the optics in your telescope. And depending on what target you're shooting at, you need different cameras with different specs. The first thing you need to do when you're picking a camera is you need to look at the telescope you're going to attach it to. Telescopes have what's called a image circle. How big of a circle can it put the light on? The closer you get to the edge of that image circle, the fainter the light's gonna be, so the darker it's going to be. So you wanna make sure that you pick a camera with a sensor size that is as large as possible without getting too close to the edge. So as I said, there are different specs on the cameras that we're looking for depending on the different targets. Deep sky objects are relatively large in the night sky and have a larger angular size than the moon, some of them, but they will often be very, very faint. So that means we just need to collect a lot of light over a long period of time in order to take pictures of these deep sky objects. Now, when it comes to planetary cameras, it's a completely different ballgame, where before we were looking at relatively large objects that's very faint, now we're looking at very tiny objects that is very, very bright. So what we're looking at now is actually to be able to resolve a small but bright object. 